Farm equipment on county roads. It's the first sign of spring and farmers are starting to move tractors, preparing fields for planting. Agriculture is our number one industry and, and, and we have got to be able to get out and about and move from one field to the other uh, in order to take care of our operations. My name is Sid Freeman. I am a Canyon County farmer. Freeman has witnessed many farm car accidents through the years and it spurred him to action. Uh, I actually witnessed uh, the devastation of a, of a collision right here. Freeman and Canyon County Farm Bureau started an ag safety public service announcement campaign. Um, I talked to board into uh, rejuvenating an old uh, uh, PSA uh, program that we had had previously uh, back in the uh, early 90s and, and late 80s. And, and uh, so we brought that uh, together again and, and it's running, still running today. Um, and we've ex actually expanded that to include um, our bordering counties. They, they also help, help us buy the airtime, whether it be TV or, or radios. Uh, After those PSAs, did you see a difference in accidents? Yes, yes we have. I really believe that uh, uh, we are having an impact with those uh, PSAs. And Freeman says overwhelming that speed and driving too close are the cause of most county road accidents. You've, you've got to just be patient. Most farmers uh, and their employees will try to pull over at a safe location to let traffic go by. Sometimes the farmers cannot see directly behind them. We may not even know you're back there, especially if we're like on a combine. As the 21 season gets underway, the PSAs, patience, and reducing speed will save lives on county roads this year. For the Voice of Idaho Agriculture, I'm Jake Putnam.